we are free to convert because that's what uh, even the bishop says and that's what every missionary says we have the constitution and we'll do it the way we want it yeah. and it is a highly misused legislation in fact uh, i have gone one step ahead because uh, if you look at all the missionaries they have only one article that they keep quoting time and again article 25 i would say that uh, i would uh, not i am not really for the anti conversion law at the state i would want the government to look at the other center the second thing is this article 25 itself is very skewed because it says you have the opportunity you are free to practice profess and propagate this is contradictory to the hindu way of life because hindus don't go and convert right. but uh, the uh, idea of enlarging the flock is only on the abrahamic religions the two abrahamic religions in our country so right. for them it is uh, it is one of the best uh, tools to use uh, to propagate and to profess their faith so i have written to the uh, government i recommend the government that they must look at it at a national level there needs to be a discussion on article 25 i strongly recommend that uh, propagate needs to be removed uh, that is going to actually really help our nation because uh, otherwise it is going to be highly misused you look at any of these churches they the first thing they quote is article 25 and actually article 25 itself has a history if you look at article 25 itself there was initially no proposal of putting the word propagate in the constitution it right. was a handiwork of few sinister members in the constitution assembly probably people didn't realize the impact it is going to create over the next 60 70 or 100 years and today what you see is the the granulation of the article 25 <laughs>